If Harkin actually wins and fulfills the tyranny of the sun prophecy plunging the world into eternal darkness, then it's undoubtedly a boon for vampires all over Tamriel. Being immortal, they could easily bide their time and wait out the chaos. Tensions would rise between the larger factions of Tamriel, with fingers pointed at each other as they try to figure out what is going on, who did it, if it's permanent, or while their crops and livestock die off and mortal populations dwindle. Barring any interference from gods or save the day plot events, I think that Harkin, if he survived the downfall of Tamriel, as we know it, would find himself in a less satisfying situation. He craves power, but power is relative to the context you wield it in, so if he lives in a world where everyone has vampire powers, then the significance of having said powers is reduced. From a lion among sheep to a lion ruling over other lions, some of which could group together to overthrow him, he'd likely be living in a rocky, frozen place without the resources available to afford him the superficial luxuries he once enjoyed. He might be higher overall in the ruling hierarchy of Tamriel, but at what cost? 